guys, uh, it's a bit of an early morning for us. It's um, already 8-11 right now, but yeah, I've been awake with Skylar since, oh, what a smack, oh, since like 7-15, I think, and yeah, I could not sleep last yeah. night, like something, <laughs> just whether different things keep breaking me up, like I'll fall asleep for a little bit, and then Jasper will start kicking, and then I'll fall asleep again, and the heartburn will wake me up, and I'll fall asleep again, and I'll have a nightmare and it'll wake me up. I fall asleep again, and then, um, Chris, I like the window a little bit open from the, um, bedroom. And so, like, the window's right here, and I don't know what it was, but I swear, it kind of smelled like something was, like, burning. It was, like, almost 2 in the morning, and it was, like, plastic burning. It was so weird. But then, me be me, worst case scenario, is like, oh my god, what if there's a building? An apartment that's on fire and nobody knows it's like in the middle of the night and i stayed awake for a good while trying to like wait it out and see <laughs> like if it was anything serious uh but then it went away and yeah i could just not sleep i was awake from like 2 30 in the morning to like 4 30 no before it's like 4 in the morning i was awake and i could just not sleep and Chris woke up, I think it was like 4.30 in the morning. And he saw I couldn't fall asleep. So um, it was nice enough to help rub my back because I was having a lot of pelvic pains and just a lot of back pains. And Jasper was wide awake at that time. So he was kicking away my ribs. And I just, it was a long night for me. <laughs> but Skylar, she's getting her pants. But... Yeah, so I just started record my day today. Uh, not really much planned, so it's just going to be a typical day in our life. Um, lots of cleaning, cooking, organizing. <laughs> right, baby? Yeah. Yeah. You remember? Um, you remember our bed was like right over there, mm -hmm. next to that wall, and then like. And I have nightmares. You have nightmares? No, not today, but the last time. The last time. Oh. Those years yeah. ago, cause the bed was like right over there, and I was literally next to Daddy, and I have nightmares. Oh yeah. Yeah. Yeah, Annabelle struggles with that too. Always like since I can remember growing up, I always struggled with having lots of nightmares at night. And she seems to have gotten that from me because she has nightmares too. I don't um, have nightmares, don't worry. You don't have no more? You haven't had <laughs> one in a while? Um, no. That's good. Skylar! Let me show you guys real quick. <laughs> a little bit of what I have to do today. That crib was empty and now it is filled with clothes. Clean clothes that I need to fold and put away. Skylar! <laughs> oh. <laughs> she always does that. She just goes into the closet, turns on the light, and just closes the door. But it's time, to get, it's time to get up. Now I'm going to quickly get changed and just um, put something comfortable on and make breakfast, turn on the TV, put on some cartoons on for the girls. And just get settled into a day. And I'm not going to watch. I don't want to watch a movie. I want to watch it for Ali on your laptop. Okay, you can watch it for Ali. <laughs> yes. She loves to watch A for Ali. I like A for Ali. Yeah. Are you going to get ready? And pick not a cute yet. outfit? Not yet. You're going to stay in bed for a little while longer? <laughs> You're so silly. <laughs> Alright, well. Mommy's going to get up because. I'm hungry. I've been hungry since like <laughs> 5 in the morning. <laughs> you want to eat chicken breath? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Silly.
so oh my head fat is like not getting all of my little hairs. <laughs> oh. Uh, I just quickly got ready. I just put on this dress because honestly, all the like my pants and sweats are so uncomfortable. I feel like he's like really down low right here, like right what, like right where the um like the pants normally go to, and like it just feels really tight and uncomfortable. So I just do this on real quick and. I didn't even brush my hair, I just put it back with the head done because yeah, I'm just trying to be comfortable. <laughs> but I'm just gonna quickly make breakfast. Um the girls here and I are not, are not much of like breakfast eaters, like they'll usually have maybe some pancakes and some yogurt and some milk. And that's pretty much it. And then after that they won't eat until like Two, three hours later and that's gonna have like a little bit of a bigger lunch but yeah so I'm gonna make some pancakes right now and then normally while I'm cooking I do put on Grey's Anatomy it's like my comfort show so yeah I'm gonna put that on real quick just so I could cook, um, cook really quickly <laughs> this could be good for me lately I was feeling like I need a purpose Talk to me Give me the impression that I won't scratch your surface And I could walk for days Searching for your praise But is it even there to find? Is there a chance for me?
so after breakfast i like to put on some music and um i'll set up the girls play area to do some arts and crafts and for annabelle to practice her letters um and they usually they usually keep them pr pretty occupied for a good while which gives me time to quickly clean up around the house So for Skylar, she really likes painting, so I just set up her paintings along with her paintbrushes and her water. And as you can see, she's still learning. Uh, she tends to just wet the entire paper with water. Uh, but with Annabelle, I have her practice her letters while she's also watching some cartoons. So I'm gonna go ahead and write down the whole alphabet for her, for her to copy and write on her own. So now that I have them all nice and busy, it's time for me to do all the cleanup around. I usually like to start from one side of the house and make my way all the way around. Me put my slippers on, so she went ahead and grabbed her for animals as well. And she likes to come and try and help me out. <laughs>
Okay, at this point I'm usually getting a little bit tired I need to sit down for a little bit because the whole standing up and bending down like constantly starts giving me really bad pains. But I do have this laundry put away. Annabelle is still um, practicing her alphabet. Skylar was painting and I put on um, Toy Story on for them. I usually only like to take about an hour of like cleaning. Um, you think you will clean at the end of the day, but personally, I like to do it in the mornings. And then usually all the cleaning you just let me do. I'll clean because I clean every single day. I like to I function so much better if the house is clean. Um, the blankets I wash them at least like twice a week, and then when it comes to like the mopping, I'll do it like three times a week. And then a little bit I'm gonna vacuum, but I do that last because then soon after I'm done with all the laundry is usually when the girls will have um, a small lunch and I wait until after that mess <laughs> to do the vacuuming because they like to sit like right where the carpet is. Um, but yeah, so I'm just gonna get started <laughs> on the laundry because uh, I do not want to leave the pile on and on and on because later on it's just like going to be so much more and yeah that's not going to be no fun. I personally just, I think out of all the cleaning to do, I hate laundry the most. Not really doing it, it's just more like the putting it away and um, putting it away and folding it and all that stuff. Yeah, I don't really like that. <laughs> But yeah, um, I also wanted to give you guys a little bit of an update uh, on Monday. Today is, what's today? Today is Wednesday, February 24th. And this Monday, I actually went in, um, took Annabelle for an appointment, for an eye appointment. Uh, because by the time I was at her age, um, that's when I started wearing glasses. And um, since I wear glasses, I just want to get her eyes checked. Just... Oh, me. Yeah, you're really bored now? We'll just do a few more letters. That's it? And then that's how you can take a break, and then after you go back, we're going to do a little more homework later, okay? Sometimes that's a bit of like the hard part of like getting Annabelle to do her. Um, like practicing her letters and her numbers and all of that because it's, uh, Skylar is just like hanging out, <laughs> chilling she sees Skylar do that, she wants to be doing the same thing but um, I just gotta stick with it but yeah, like I was saying, I took Annabelle to an appointment to get her eyes checked on Monday and uh, her right eye is perfect but her left eye, um, ever since she was born, I remember she had to have multiple checkups because um, I guess she had like cataracts or something like that. Um, and it looks like she still has it. And it was obvious when they were asking her like what she saw uh, with her right eye, she was able to say like every single thing, like see it perfectly. But then once um, they got to the left eye, then that's when, like, once it got to the smaller um, objects, then that's when she struggled, she couldn't see it. Oh. So, yeah, and then they checked her eyes and then, I forgot exactly what it was called, but it was something about, like, a little, a little bit, like, like a fog in a sense. She showed me, like, a picture of how it looks like on the inside. So she does have a slight, like, I think that's what she called it, cataracts. Is that how to pronounce it? I'm not quite sure. <laughs> but she said that it's very like um, borderline, so it's not much of a concern where she like, oh, she needs glasses because um, she doesn't. So um, she just gonna have another checkup in six months just to keep an eye on it and just to see if, um, how it is by then. So as of right now, um, yeah, we just, I'm just not going to stress it. <laughs> no, she needs classes and that's totally fine. Um, but yeah, and then also that same day, later in the afternoon, I had an appointment for myself, my checkup, and that went 
okay. I'm not sure if you guys watched my last video. Um, I had had a checkup two weeks ago and have gained five pounds in two weeks, which put me at 115 pounds. And just this past Monday, I won again. And I gained another five pounds in two weeks. So now I'm at 120 pounds, which um, to some of you may not seem like a lot, but I am a very tiny person. <laughs> and I have never in my life weighed that much. So it was a bit of a shock for me. Um, which, I mean, it's great. I'm happy that I'm gaining weight because I always struggle with that. Um, it's just I feel like it's probably what ha also has to do so much with my body because, um, yeah, I just get a lot of pains. Um, it's like I'll be cooking for a while or cleaning or like any kind of movement, kind of like bending down and I'll get like really uh, like cramps and then like a stabbing pain like down low like really bad to the point where like I freeze up and I can't move um, and that's pretty annoying especially with me because I like to be like almost non-stop <laughs> all day long I gotta keep up with the girls and um, I like to clean and just you know everyday things and so sometimes it gets in the way and I feel frustrated because I can't I have to take it easy and my doctor told me to just you know take it easy as much as possible um, I'm trying <laughs> I'm really trying but I just I can't I function better when I'm doing something <laughs> um, but yeah thankfully Chris is a huge help but even then I still just uh, just I can't wait to have this baby already and so yeah and once i told my doctor about the, like the symptoms the pains i was having then she seemed a little bit concerned so in two weeks i will be having actually march 9th i will be having another checkup uh, with a different doctor who seems um i think she said she will be uh, doctor will be checking me and then most likely I will be getting another ultrasound done just to check and see just to make sure that everything's okay with the baby um, um, just to make sure there's no other reason for like what could possibly be causing the pain because it is really bad it's I've never had pains like this before with any of my other pregnancies and this is my fourth baby so um, yeah, it's definitely a lot, the most painful. And usually when I go through labor, I won't cry. <laughs> like, um, my pain tolerance is, I will say, pretty good. Um, so, yeah, like, during my labors, I wouldn't cry or anything. I just, you know, like, I'll be calm. The only part I will probably cry during is during the IV. <laughs> because I just absolutely hate needles and they always stab me a bunch of times because I can't get it right. But these pains are so bad to the point I cry. I will be crying in the middle of the night. I will cry during, throughout the day when it gets really bad. Um, and it's just, it's just really, really horrible. I can't, I don't know how else to explain it, but they are just really painful and I cannot wait to give birth and hopefully feel like myself again but I think that's pretty much it I did my glucose test uh, which I passed everything is good and um, I always seem to be anemic during my pregnancies but this time around everything's good with that so that's great and yeah I can't really think of like any other updates I think that's pretty much it as of like um, doctor's appointments and stuff um, I won't really know much more until March 9th so I'll do another update then I should be I think I'll be 36 weeks by then so we'll see how that goes <laughs> but yeah um, there's really nothing else to say I'm just gonna keep doing laundry um, 
I don't really think I have much more cleaning to do. Um, it's usually just the, the laundry and then I have the blanket washing. I have two more to wash. And after that, it's just vacuuming. And that will be pretty much it as of cleaning for today only because um, I don't want to do it, like overdo it either. So, and I do like to split my time between like um, the house chores and as well with like spending time with the girls and their, um, their learning and stuff like that. So yeah, um, I'm just gonna finish this up and then I will get right back to you guys once I'm done. Okay, so I <laughs> I just finished putting away all of the laundry. It is now all cleared out and cleared out. I have the um the other blankets in the dryer. Oh my god. Whew. <laughs> I have the other blankets in the um, in the dryer, and then the other two are in the washer right now currently. So um, yeah, that, I think that's all I'm gonna wash today. It's just mainly those. Um, just kind of quickly made the bed real, um, really fast, and then as of for like the clothes, I just quickly put them away, and we are now. <laughs> Just gonna shut this, but yeah, that's pretty much it for my cleaning. Oh, I gotta show you guys the bump really quickly on how it is looking. <laughs> I like it's looking pretty big, and. And yeah, I'm gonna be living in dresses until this baby comes out because nothing else fits, nothing else is comfortable. But yeah, I just, oh, I can't wait to meet him. But, um, oh yeah, another thing I wanted to quickly show you guys. Um, we do have, sorry, Monica. We do have a baby registry for the first time ever in after four kids <laughs> my sister friend, uh, convinced me to make one and some people uh, some friends actually were really sweet enough one friend was sweet enough to send me um she got me like five different items she got me this little uh tummy time pillow it's from target and it comes with these two little toys it's so cute she also got me diapers and some baby bottles and um, to like wash the bottles, a little brush. So that was really nice of her. Um, I have just a blanket for Jasper. It is his brother's Jaden's um, that he will be reusing. And then just a swaddle. Just realized, of course, we're probably eating something. <laughs> Gotta clean it up. <laughs> but um, yeah. And then next to his crib. I have um, just this whole thing full of newborn diapers. Um, I don't think I'm gonna buy it anymore. Oh wait, no, that's Chris's mess. <laughs> so it's just this full of uh, newborn diapers. Um, I'm not gonna buy any more because honestly, it's like the size that I feel they outgrow the fastest. And then to um, my mom to get him size two diapers. So I have those up there for when he ends up um, using them. And then just more white bees and then diapers for Skylar. Yeah. Yes, baby. Did yeah. you break it? Look at you, you're such a mess. She's having snacks and then she painted. <laughs> and she's gonna have lunch in a little bit. But yeah, and then also I started started packing my diaper bag, my diaper bag, sorry, my um, my hospital bag. So this is the only bag I will be taking. I already have all of his things packed in here. Now I just gotta um, pack just my outfit, breastfeeding pads, period pads, and I think that is it. 
Hey guys! <laughs> and then um, this other company, I'll tag it, like I'll put the ad right here on Instagram. But they were sweet enough to send me this uh, for baby Jasper. It's this, um, I forgot the word exactly, but um, it's really cute. And I decided I'm going to later on after, I'm going to be vlogging when I completely deep clean my car and buy the car seats uh, because I'm buying three brand new car seats for all three kids. And I'm going to keep this in, he in there in my car just at all times. So I have diapers for um, the baby, for Jasper, and then for Skylar as well because she still is in diapers. And then white bees, butt cream, and just a bunch of like burp cloths and cloth, um, burp rock racks and stuff like that. And then this is just like a swaddle. Let me show you guys really quickly so you guys could check out the company because when I saw this, I was like, oh, how did I know, not know about this before? Okay, so focused, focus. So um, it came in a pack of three, and so it's like makes it really easy to uh, swaddle them. And so you put baby in here, so neck goes right here, and then you put baby in here, and then you pull this one all the way over and like under them, obviously. And then this one right here, actually, they like. This one's come undone, and then so you pull this one over the baby, and then you see this part right here. It just like sticks to it, like like that, and it's pretty secure. And that way, your baby's all swaddled up. Hey guys. Um, but yeah, this is, I'm definitely going to be using these like all the time for him, especially just to make it a lot easier. Uh, because I don't know about you guys, but any other parent, like mom out there, I do not like like the whole receiving blanket thing and then, like, wrapping it up. Are you okay? Yeah. But yeah, um, I'll make sure I leave it at and I tag them on the link down below as well. But yeah, I'm going to be having this one in my car. I'm just waiting soon to be able to buy the car seats to completely deep clean and empty out my car. Um, so that I can show you guys that. Um, stop it. Can you please stop? That's pretty much it. There's really not much else going um, today it's actually time now to make the girls um, some lunch and they usually really enjoy just having a soup so I'm gonna make them I'm gonna make them a soup really quickly and cut up some apples for them before I start cooking for later I don't know what I'm gonna have for lunch yet I'm just like I'm not really that hungry yet. I'm gonna put you guys down right there. But yeah, I'm not really that hungry yet. Um, I'm already done with all the cleaning and it's only noon, so perfect time for lunch time. And then usually um, I sit them down and the girls will eat and they'll continue, they'll finish watching the movie that they're watching and I'll take that time to go and check like my emails or um, any collaborations I might be having, just responding to those or editing or like any kind of like work kind of stuff that I need to do. And that's when I take the time right now during the lunch time um, because it's when I'm able to relax a lot better knowing that like okay, the house is clean, the girls are fed, I can relax now and then uh, yeah and then after that it's um, a half bell do a little bit of more um, of her letters and numbers and stuff like that and that's when we'll sit down and I'll let the girls decide like um, what they want to play 
Um, I think Annabelle said that she wanted to do like our nails today, so I'm gonna pull out like um, all the nail polishes I have and stuff like that, and then after that, probably do a shower before we play, just um, in case. Well, just in case Skyler takes a nap, um, she usually nap around two o'clock. Um, I added that to her schedule recently, and it's been working out good. She's a lot in a more better mood compared to like before she would nap and then by 7 p.m. she was already really grouchy <laughs> but um, yeah so I'm just gonna cook really quickly and get them settled down and I'll get back to you guys right now oh. Oh, I ended up having to change I was having a cup of cold water and um, Skylar was about to fall off the couch so like I leaned forward to try and catch her and like like push my cup of water all over the couch and on my butt and everything so I ended up changing but um, the girls are finishing up in the shower what's wrong? what's wrong? they're finishing up in the shower so I'm just gonna serve them this soup really quickly um, I'm gonna serve them their soup so that way it starts cooling down by the time that um, they're all changed or dry and dressed. Um, and hopefully I can get them down for a nap soon because I did not, like I mentioned, did not sleep that good last night. And I am tired, I am sleepy, and I am achy. Yeah, I'm just gonna start having this already set up. That way it's a lot faster, it cools down because I don't have any ice to like pull it down. It's such a pretty day outside by the way. It's like nice and sunny and it's like there's a breeze, it's pretty windy and then it looks really nice. Like there's a palm tree, there's two palm trees right outside our windows. And I love like watching them just go. All over, all over the place. Okay, so I have our plates ready. Let me go put them on the table. <laughs> she's out of her shower now, and she's eating her soup. She's so cute. <laughs> okay, go eat. I don't like sharks. Go eat your food now. Sit on the couch and have mine. And I'm gonna see if I have any emails I need to respond to. Just anything in general that I need to get done. I need to move around freely to play the game, so I must completely clean. This usually ends up falling asleep after her lunch <laughs> napping for like the remaining of the day we like 
just woke up. Um, the girls were pretty tired too. And um, Chris is already coming home. So I'm going to quickly get... Um, I'm gonna quickly get dinner started just so it's ready by the time he like gets here and then take his, takes his shower and all that stuff. I'm in a hurry, so. Uh, where is the pan? Where is it? Where did I do it? I washed it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> Yeah, I'm just gonna quickly cook him some food and I like to cook extra that way I can just um he can eat dinner and then there for it to be leftovers for him to be able to take tomorrow for his lunch in the morning. So I'm gonna do that. And I think he said he was bringing the girls pizza! a pizza, so the girls are really excited for that. <laughs> Um, that way they could have a slice of pizza and then I like to give them some I'm making just some chicken and some red rice and and I'm gonna boil some eggs and I think that's pretty much it oh I like them baby they're red this time yeah like my hands okay, this chicken is like there we go Need a little bit of warm water. Well, it's kind of like stuck together. But I know Chris is really tired today. He ended up. Um, he said he just did like extra work today. Excuse me, Belle. You're right in the way where I need to be. He did like extra work today, so um, he's just tired. So I just want to make sure. They're not ready. And this girl's already bringing the chairs over so they can like. I'm so cold. I'm gonna go party first. Go ahead then. Dad. Do you need Mommy. help with something, Missy? And then your mama. Huh? Da, 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 da. Do you need help with something? My daddy. What? My daddy. Dada's almost here. Yeah. I'm making some yummy food for Dada. Ah. Ah. Making some yummy food for Dada. Yeah. There we go. <laughs> hey guys. Okay, you guys talk to the camera for a little bit while mommy. Yeah. Um, I guess I get my toes. <laughs> I paint my toes sometimes. Sometimes I want to paint my toes sometimes. <laughs> Hi guys, um, we are going to make food for my daddy, so yeah. we are going to, dad's going to bring us pizza and see his on his way home, and then so we can have dinner tonight, and my dad will take us back bread, and then we can go to bed, drink our milk, bottle some milk, <laughs> You're so cute, you know exactly what I'm I don't you know exactly what to say, huh? What do you need yeah. to do too? Yeah, because that's why we got today to do, and we're gonna watch a movie. Yeah. And then we are gonna watch a movie because it's guy, what are you doing? This guy's being crazy because today, because guy is being crazy today. Um, and I'm gonna need you guys to move out of the way because I need to watch the pop. I need oh. my class. Mommy, be right there because I want to talk to you. I know. It's, the oil is jumping. I need you guys to out of the way, actually. But I want to see the camera. I'll fix up the camera for you guys right now. Okay, um, it's two days later. I ended up not 
vlogging um, the rest of the day the other day we just had dinner and um, I went to bed <laughs> that was pretty much it nothing interesting but it's two days later and I'm actually really excited because we received three packages um, if you guys know I do like um, if you go on my Instagram I like work with companies sometimes and they send me stuff um, so yeah I just wanted to quickly show you guys a few of the items that I'm really excited about so okay, for, you guys a little bit lower. for the first thing it's um, this little uh, it's called the Ogi Bear it's for babies for like their nose or their ears and I thought it'd come in handy you know for Skyler <laughs> For Jasper so yeah I still haven't opened it and then they also sent me um, I already have one smart like camera which is so right there I saw Chris is able to keep an eye on us <laughs> throughout the day when he's at work but they actually sent me a different brand another one it's the Ecobee smart camera and I have it right here and this one is slightly bigger than this one over here and definitely a lot heavier. Let me show you guys. So this is oh that this is like a magnet thing that goes in there. But this is what it looks like and I believe it came with like a charger and everything. I actually need to read more about it about every single thing that it does. But the charger is in there. And yeah, and instructions and everything. I'm debating whether to have this one like at the front door. Um, like by the big window over there. I'm not sure yet though, but yeah. And then the last product that they sent me was the, um, another product from Delta Children. It's the Deluxe Play Yard, which is actually right here. And I'm going to like set it up really quickly um hopefully i can figure it out chris did it last night but then took it back apart but yeah let's do that really quickly so i can show you guys i'm probably gonna struggle honestly <laughs> so bear with me but i want you to put this together I'm gonna be using it for <laughs> Skylar as long uh, along with um, Jasper because it comes with extra pieces. But she seems to really be liking it. You wanna put the rest of it together? Hey, stop! <laughs> She's way too excited for it. Can you help Sissy out? Okay, so I'm actually 
not gonna finish setting it up only because Ow! I wanna leave just like I wanna leave just the playpen. Um but it's pretty much like this and it has like a little storage space on the side along with the changing table <laughs> that kind of already put a baby in but um yeah changing table and then it also comes with like the little hanger thing yeah uh, but i don't have all the other pieces the pieces are like over Mom, here i'm and gonna then... show it to him i'm gonna show it to him can you move that over here please okay. and then it also comes with the other piece for for like the higher um, level up but mm. i'm not gonna add that yet only because um, I too. one second maybe i'm not gonna add that yet only because um i am planning on using the little play pen first for skylar um tomorrow we're gonna be going out somewhere to the to the park and i want to take the play pen just for her to be in there and take some blankets and stuff but later on, I'll show you guys like the full complete setup I'll have it in once Jasper is born. Um, <laughs> but this is fun. This is awesome. They're actually both in it right now, and they're this looks is so fun. cute. It's not too bad. It's pretty, right? Oh, <laughs> mommy didn't clip it in yet. I said I'm gonna take it out, baby. Why? But yeah, I think that's gonna be it for today's video i have some things that i need to get done um and yeah thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe um and i'll see you guys in the next one thank you for watching bye say bye bye